what are you? Prime. You're prime? Top notch. What makes you time, prime, top notch, who tank? Oh, I mean, I have everything that you could possibly ask for as far as brains, beauty, ambition. I would build my man up to be everything he wants to be in this world. I'm, I'm the best investment he would ever make in his life. And my shit exclusive. I've invested in my body. I've a lot of men agree that these are the things that they are not looking for in a woman. They say these are not the, the qualities of women that they're looking for a partner. But she's she, she just mentioned all of those things that men are not looking for in a partner, th those qualities. $50,000 body. No one barely touches me. Yes, you can see me on Instagram because I'm paid to do that, but nobody touches me unless a man, yes, does take care of me. I like bosses. I like millionaires. I like someone who's going to mentor me, teach me, and invest in me and get me to my highest level as well. And just to be clear, what's a $150,000 body? Uh, Four BBLs. Two breast augment, technically five BBLs, but we're going to go with four. Uh, two breast augmentations. So technically the $150,000 $150, body is just plastic. <laughs> Obviously Botox, Botox, lip, lip injections, and then I had the fat buckle removed out of my cheeks on my face. Wow. And how young are you? 28. 28. And what age do you want to get married? 28. Uh, I, I wait, 28? That woman looked like a good, honestly speaking, probably 35. Not joking with you. I'd probably say 35 off top, maybe 37. I'm not judging, but I thought she's like 40 something. I'm older than her, but she looks like 10 years older than me. Don't you think, guys? <laughs> don't embarrass me. <laughs> I don't necessarily have a time restraint on myself. I feel like God's going to... She's you know, 28? Make Only with my future husband when that time is right. So are you comfortable? Uh, I probably have about another ten million in real estate that I need to develop. She gonna lie on God now. <laughs> what she just said. She just said she put a hundred and fifty thousand into her body, making it look like this. And you think God would be happy with you doing with doing this with your body? That's interesting. Wait, 28, even after all of those procedures that she did, it didn't help. It didn't make you look young or fresh. That's just my opinion. I don't know. What do you guys think? Before that, um, so that I can reach the caliber of man that I want to be my future husband. Got it. And how convinced are you that a man is attracted to a girl with ambition? I'm sorry, guys. And, and it's heartbreaking because she's serious. She's dead serious. And she actually believes that she's on the right path. You can see in the way she's talking. Oh, I'm all business. I, I think a man would like me. She's really presenting herself. And men are not going to want this at all. You did all that work to look a certain way, to attract a certain man. And the man is probably not even going to want you. You're probably going to price yourself out of the market. Literally. Brains, $10 million in real estate, or just being nice and sweet. What do you think a man is most interested in? Especially... The man that you're looking for who's worth millions of dollars does he want a, a, a ambitious boss babe or a nice compliant beautiful girl that doesn't give him headaches what do you think most men like that would prefer i don't i'm not looking for what most men or most well you should be because you want like. that kind of guy so you what should do you be. mean I, no i'm looking so for I'm like asking, that, that one in a million where i'm you're looking at like grant and elaine cardone you're looking at okay. like you know power couples jay-z beyonce those people are building an empire together and they're equally but Jay-Z was, he was doing his own thing. And Beyonce, I, I see what you're saying, but <laughs> you're, it's not going to, I'm telling you, this is different. This is not going to happen. I know you're trying to be like the boss babe and all that stuff. And this is what I want. Grant Cardone, <laughs> if he says we're moving somewhere, she's going to move, period. That's it. That's the type of personality that this man has. You are not built like that. You are not set up like that. Fully contributing. So, reality right now, you're not going to marry Jay-Z or Grant Cardone. For the sake of this conversation, you're going to marry some no, successful own, guy. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. So that guy, how much is he worth? Close Make to up a number. 100 million. Okay, so that guy that's worth $100 million, yeah. go with me here now, yeah. Kay. Does he want a boss babe trying to sell real estate? Or a Crying. nice, lovely, compliant girl who's willing to get on his schedule? What do you think that guy wants? I, think I want to I know think they want what me. he They're thinks. They're constantly pursuing me. What 
her confidence level is super really i i have i haven't met any any girl here in the philippines who who think this way i mean i have met some some girls here who are like uh like very independent they call themselves independent because they they are working they can they can help their family they can support themselves um but n not like like this oh i deserve someone who's making this and i deserve someone who's rich and this and that i, I haven't <laughs> i feel like she is she acting is this not scripted maybe they paid her to to do this this is like another level what well, do you mean why why aren't you married to one yet though because i don't want to be married to one yet i thought you just I've been said building you... my own business but i thought you've been proposed to twice and turned it down it wasn't you the right turned one. down a guy worth a hundred million dollars twice 50 million but yes why in the world would you turn him down <laughs> because i still had things to do so you think that you're just gonna go find another guy worth 50 million dollars is ready to wipe no, you up no i like i said 100 million i like okay, double so down. the 50 million guy was just too poor for you no he just wasn't the right one you do realize i am super shocked <laughs> i'm really super shocked <laughs> there might be people in the comments calling you absolutely delusional right now That's do you funny. realize that i don't care what they have to say okay so i'm asking you I to put yourself <laughs> take off the i'm a hot girl paid 150 grand boss babe okay. priceless punani take that off okay Put on the hundred million <laughs> guy, guys hat. are you ready to play this game okay don't answer like you're k Answer like you're, give me a guy's name that you'd be willing to marry. A guy's name. I'm sorry. Think of a name. Think of a uh, name. $100 million guy. I don't, I don't know. Let's call him Jay-Z. Let's, <laughs> let's call him Jay, because okay. we're not talking of Jay-Z. Jay is worth $100 million. Uh -huh. Okay, do you think, think about it, money. he cares how much money you make? No. You don't. Okay, let's stop there. Do you think he cares about your attitude? He, uh, to an extent, yeah. To an extent, yeah. he cares so a lot about you. Cares a lot about your attitude. Yeah. I have a great attitude. Now, no, you okay. don't. <laughs> no, you don't. You're just... not worth a hundred million dollars, so your opinion doesn't matter. Oh, I mean, you just said you turn only down. a person that's worth a hundred million dollars' opinion yeah. matters. As far as me, like being on an intimate relationship, okay. yeah. Let's put let's put the hat back on, okay. Jay. <laughs> so, what is Jay looking for? Again, remove yourself and your real estate ambitions from the if equation jay, what is jay looking if for that jay if this particular jay wants a simple sarah there's no sarah's here right yeah that's her right there <laughs> yeah sarah, you just pissed off the wrong girl <laughs> simple, it's like a, 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 a yeah simple sam whatever okay then uh, you can find a million of those you can go to the club you can go find a girl in college or it's something so simple like that you can find them a, a like uh, every hundred girls is the same person like yeah but but the the point is men don't like complicated girls they don't like hard one simple it is you just said the word simple that's it yeah simple i'm one in a million as well and a hundred million dollar man usually likes the extraordinary i'm a, i'm a, i'm attracting the extraordinary can i ask you something can i ask yeah, McQueen. can i what do you think like what are the top three things that you think that man values I think he values business. From who? And you? the things that are that she's mentioning are the things that men will look at uh, in a partner. No, in general, his life. And, okay. And he needs someone who understands that. Okay. And a, and a girl who's who is just simple and will comply. She's there for the money. A woman who has it on her own isn't there just for the money. Okay. So what's what's own. what's the sec? What's the last two things besides the first one you just? So so why do you why are you requiring a min, million a 100 million dollar guy then if you don't care about the money you said simple you, you said you're not simple and you said the simple women are only there for the money but why are she's requiring a 100 million dollar guy because maybe she's making around 20 million or wh whatever she's making but she wants to get with a man that can elevate her up that can teach her things Modern women are so dumb that they think that just because a man isn't at a certain monetary level, financial level, that he can't teach her things. There's plenty of men off rip right now that can teach her a lot about life. I mean, a lot about life because she's missing it right now. So we have he cares about business. Let's see what else he cares about. Are you requiring a man who is one hundred million dollar worth? I would say family. Why? Looking for someone that they can procreate with, someone to take on their legacy. Do you think that someone they and want they to procreate with cares more about money than actually being a submissive, compliant woman? 
I'm sorry, what was the question? I'm saying, do you think that they want to procreate with someone who thinks like you as opposed to a compliant, submissive woman? I would, I would assume so, yes. That's where, that's, that's how I look. Okay, well, you shouldn't use the word because there are people with disabilities. I mean, you really, sh I mean, you shouldn't say that, you know, someone who's not worth $100 million shouldn't be worthy of talking, but, you know, hey, you, you did. So it is what it is, you know. But, hey, you know, like I said, you, know, you have your opinions, and, you know, I'm, yeah. just, I'm just putting this out there that it's like, that's not what men value. They don't want, like, a aggressive, you know, dominant woman that cares more about money and real estate and millions of dollars as opposed to being a respectful, loyal, compliant woman. They just don't. Okay. I'm trying to help you out because, you know, you just turned down a, a niche worth $50 million. Yeah. <laughs> Acting like they just down the street. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, <laughs> uh, would you say that you're agreeable? To? No, just in general. Would you say you're more agreeable or more disagreeable? Depends on the in topic. general, like, topic. so for instance, if you ask me, Adam, are you agreeable or disagreeable? I'm disagreeable as f Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm deceptive. Okay. So you too. I'm very deceptive. Yeah. Okay, so you too. Why am I disagreeable? Because if I see some, ch I was like, yo, I don't like how the cameras are set up. Yo, can we move these chairs? Yo, what? I'm, I'm not going to move. Yeah. 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 Uh, the reason that I've killed it in sales and doing what I do is just because I'm not, I don't go along with the flow. Yep. I do my thing. Now, here's my question to you. If that dude comes along, do you think he wants an agreeable woman or a non-agreeable, disagreeable woman? That dude with our $100 million. What do you want? I'm asking you. I'm asking you. Yeah, you better agree, okay? Okay. Uh, if I'm worth $100 million and I'm like, hey, baby, need you to do this. Don't be like, why am I doing this? I'll be like, all right, so get me something. Marissa, get your ass over here. Now you're next. <laughs> because that dude, you know what he has? He's got, ready, wait for it, options. So if you don't get on his page, th you said, McQueen, you don't even got $100 million. Why are you I know, man. I, I don't even know why you're here right now. Yeah, so I don't even know. I hear what you're saying. You got confidence. You got your swag. You spent 150 grand on your body. Do your thing, whatever. I'm just letting you know, sweetheart. So he ended up saying the more disagreeable you get, the, the more likely it is that you're going to be packing up stuff at that dude's house. And I couldn't agree more. Men, yeah, they like business. They like to do things in terms of building themselves up, but really it's business in terms of providing, in terms of building a structure. And you come in, if you're always fighting with him about which direction to go and what to do, he is not going to like that at all. I don't know what that $50 million a, a, a year or whatever it was, guy was doing, but <laughs> you said no to him. I, you might have just missed the boat. Because it, it seems like when you actually listen to her, she might be a nice person, but she is just so focused on getting something when she already had it. Most women work to get a man with this much money and you just threw him away. And this is why men are like, you can't make him happy at any level. This is why they think that because you say stupid stuff like a man with uh, worth 50 million I turned him down because I had other stuff to do. You could have done that with him and you want to be a partner to him, but you turned, you turned the man down. Oh, I want to be a partner to you. Y'all could have gotten a hundred million together. If your head is in the right place, y'all could have gotten a 200 million together, but you don't understand that because you're thinking silly. Modern women logic.